Good evening, everybody. My name is Murunji Bonita, and I'm going to recite a poem entitled, How to Be a Woman. When I was considered mature by my grandmother, she called me, come sit next to me, Nalumansi, my dear. I walked to her, my hips swaying, and she told me, let me teach you. Let me tell you how to be a woman. The first thing that you should know of being a woman, you must keep silent, never talk, never say anything to a man. Why? When he comes to you, you should part your legs ever so slightly. You should not hesitate because if you hesitate, you will make him mad. You will make him angry. You will make him beat you. You will make him stronger. You, Nalumansi, are you listening? Nalumansi, are you listening? I looked at my grandmother, my vision swayed away from her words. I want to see the world, I want to know how it feels to learn. Mother, are you listening to me? Nalumansi, my dear, do not say anything. Nalumansi, my dear, you need to know how to be the perfect woman. To be the perfect woman, you must learn how to cook and clean and cook and clean. You must learn how to give birth to children. That is the only thing you are worth, Nalumansi. You should learn, you should teach your other daughters, Nalumansi. They told me of a word called equality. Equality, I don't know how to spell it, but I've heard it equality i think it's a word where people are the same maybe if i told my grandmother maybe nalumansi maybe nalumansi will be a name that she will say you can go out into the world and make your name known nalumansi nalumansi you must clean nalumansi you must cook nalumansi you must kneel when you're speaking to a man if you do not then you are not my grandchild nalumansis are you hearing nalumansis my grandmother is telling you how to be the perfect woman nalumansis you all must kneel down nalumansis you should not sit on these chairs it's for the men nalumansis are you hearing me what is this word called equality does equality look like me and the man standing next to each other i do not think so does equality look like me speaking on this stage i do not think so maybe equality is me cooking in the kitchen maybe equality is me sewing my husband's shirt maybe equality is me giving birth to my fifth child maybe equality is found somewhere in the clouds i do not know how to climb there i do not know how to reach maybe equality is in the sole of my feet that have traveled each and every day maybe equality is somewhere within me i do not know where it is i do not know how far i must go but my grandmother, she tells me, Nalumansi, my dear, stop that show. Nalumansi, my dear, how to be a perfect woman. You must keep quiet. You must put your legs for your husband. Even when you do not want, you must not hesitate. Nalumansi, to be the perfect woman, you must be able to hold your peace. But what world is peace if I cannot have my say in it? What is this world if I cannot have my say in it? Are you listening? Where is equality? Who is equality? How can I be equal if my grandmother thinks I'm nothing? Where is this equality that I long for? <laughs>